Hey guys, so I hope you're having a lovely start to a new month. Yes, it is a bit cold, it is a bit dreary, but we are close to Christmas now. So today I'm going to talk about a little booktube meetup I went to last weekend. The meetup was called the Book Lovers Meetup and it was organised by the awesome Benjamin of Tomes who I will link to down in the doobly doo below. On Saturday morning we all met in Hyde Park at 11am on a beautiful beautiful day. We were so lucky with the weather. We all sat around and chatted for a while and got to know each other before heading off across London to do some book shopping. We spent our time in two bookshops which is the Charing Cross Foils and the Piccadilly Waterstones. If you are from London or you're going to London and haven't been to either of these stores, go because they are both amazing. The Foils in London is absolutely beautiful and it has a lot of books that are quite hard to find in the UK. It also has American editions and on top of that it's one of the rare places in the UK you can find signed editions of books. I bought this gorgeous edition of Codename Verity by Elizabeth Wine. Look, it's signed. From there we headed over to Waterstones which is my favourite place on earth. It is my second home and if you find me in London I'll probably be in that Waterstones. It is actually the largest bookstore in Europe and it's five stories so I cannot recommend it enough and they do awesome deals. After we'd been to Waterstones we all kind of had a couple drinks together and then went to Chipotle to have food and then we all headed back home our separate ways. It was a really fantastic day and it was a really good opportunity for me to meet some other booktubers like me who don't have huge audiences or are new and just chat about things we love aka books I just want to give a couple shout outs firstly to all the amazing booktubers I met you were all so lovely and so friendly and so funny and I'm so glad I got a chance to meet you all and thank you for those of you who've already subscribed to my channel I'm sure we're gonna have loads of conversations on here and I hope to see you all again in the near future and my second shout out is the big one and this is to the lovely Ben Ben was the first person to come up to me when I arrived in Hyde Park and say hi and welcome me. There were 53 of us and he had to get us all across London safely. And he did that and I know he was super stressed about people having a good time and everyone being safe, but we were all safe and everyone I spoke to had an amazing time. Ben is just the nicest guy and he's so funny and I'm so glad I got the opportunity to meet him and I'm hoping we can see each other soon. Hey Ben, if you're watching this, you did suggest a collab. On this whole topic though, I just want to say if you get a chance to go to a YouTube meetup or convention, take it. For me, going to this was quite a lot of stress because I had to wait for my work grade to come out and then swap shifts and then get my tickets late so it was really expensive to get to London, but it was 100% worth it. I had such a great time and just so many lovely people. The other YouTube convention I've been to was VidCon and VidCon was genuinely the best weekend of my life. Both of these I kind of did on a whim. I realised I'd be in the right place at the right time or I could be in the right place at the right time time and bought tickets and went on my own. And I know going on your own can be really intimidating, but do it. So many people at these events are on their own. And I know a lot of the bigger conventions even have groups like Lone Wolves, who are awesome and just everyone who goes on their own meets up and gets to know each other. The VidCon Lone Wolves Facebook page was actually how I found my roommates at VidCon, including Emmy Reads. And as you know, we are now BFFs. If you are going to one of these events alone, all I can say is be confident. I'm sure that everyone is just as nervous as you. So that's pretty much it. It went from a video about a specific meetup to general tips on going to conventions. If any of you guys went to Book Lovers Meetup and I've not subscribed to you or I've not said hi to you yet, please comment below. I would love to subscribe to you all and carry on chatting to you because you were just really nice. And I wonder how many times I've said that now in this video. If you've got any more tips for people going to meetups or conventions, post them below because I'm sure that'll help someone out. But that's pretty much it for today. I hope you're having a lovely day. As always, like, comment and subscribe if you liked it, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!